Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome to the Breakfast Club. You're joining with me, Charlemagne, the Gout. No, I'm Jacob. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm Jacob. It's another episode of Tired Talk. You know what I'm saying? Episode 17, I believe. 17? Yeah. 17, yeah. You're joined by your boy, AB. It's your boy, Kyojin. You prick. You stupid prick. I started yeah, yeah. first so you can say co-host. What if I didn't want to say co-host today, huh? So why are you saying, why are you taking my thing? What do you mean, bro? This guy is moving like he monopolized the word boy, bro. Oh, my Just, God. just because you're still acting so like why a childish guy, yeah? So, wait, wait, wait. You said that your old mouth, yeah? Uh, let me start, yeah? So you can say your boy AB. And you said the same thing. Why? So why did I start? You, did you think about saying your boy instead of saying your co-host last week? Your what? Just because just you went second. I you always to, say your... I just, always just, say... Just because you went second, up. yeah? Just because you went second, yeah? Listen. Doesn't mean you, you have to say co Just because... Just because... Really anyway, shut up, my Audem. Introduce yourself, please. You He's saying, introduced guys? before him, bro. It's a special guest again. You know, special Audem guest, anymore, man. Or ads, or agony ads. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 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 but yeah, man. Doing with another episode. Lando was running a bit late. You know what I'm saying? He had to strap up some sea fools and some semtexes and that. <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> Jake, man, I'm gonna introduce what we're doing today. Before that, wherever you're watching, make sure you drop a like, comment, subscribe, please, follow, please. tag somebody else. You know, if you're enjoying what we're doing, then you know, share that that enjoyment with your friends and family. In it, you know I mean, just like tell your dog, your aunt, your aunt to watch it, your neighbor, everyone, man. All of that, all of that, especially your Marge. <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> oh yeah, no, seriously, come on, man, please, man, follow us up. Subscribe, man. We need our YouTube subscribers. Are, are bro? I watched the. I, I see. I pre the analytics. Yeah, fifth like forty eight percent people who watch our shit ain't subscribed, fam. So please, if you're part of the forty eight percent, you fucking schmucks. Whoa, 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 subscribe. Whoa. It's free anyway. We're giving it's you subscribe. Wait. Just, just subscribe, man. Please. Yeah, come over to the fifty two percent. Did I did the math right? Yeah, he did. Well done. Oh, come on, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you gotta come up to the fifty-two two percent side, B. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But yeah, do you know? Do you want to tell them what we're doing today? Well, there's been a lot of talk of uh, you had to be there this week on Twitter, where people have been sharing their their childhood memories or like phases of their life that they really enjoyed. Um, so, you know, AB said so it might be a good opportunity for us to talk about some of our favorite phases of life. Maybe rank a few summers. My favorite, my favorite phase is when I got this fucking trim. <laughs> so yeah, we forgot well under the week this week, but you know, AB reminded us. I done it myself. <laughs> Check, <laughs> guys. There's, <laughs> you know, on Instagram today, yeah, today, yesterday, like this whole week, yeah. There's been some pictures where I'm thinking, oh, this guy's kind of thing. I should like that. Then I was like, wait, that looks like a party setting. I was like, fuck it, I'm not liking that picture no more. Because I just think to myself, you look good, but I just know you're stupid in it. You know what I mean? Going to a party during a panoramic. When you had that nine is block party though. Yeah, your mum was there as well. She was posting up in the curios. Well, lawyer just wanted to say that, fam. Why did your mum wear shin past the nine is block party? Yeah, yeah, bro. <laughs> she, she was wearing the meter once. But yeah, before we start off here, yeah, uh, there's one assumption that I missed out from last week here yeah, that I feel like is quite good. So mm. before we get off, Mandem, do you think that we'll be talking about such topics uh, that we talk about on the podcast if we didn't have the podcast? So we, do you think we're going to like, have, these, have these deep conversations outside of the pod? Do you think I'll talk to these lot if we went on the pod? Who's these Come lot, bro? They're, they're, where's both, where's both, the respect, bro? Both of you. <laughs> I feel like we would, you know? As in... If it came up in conversation, if the topic came up in conversation, we would go in as much detail as we do here. But obviously, it's not like we, we like if we're going to a motive or something, we'd all sit down and plan a discussion about a certain yeah, topic. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, like we do talk about these things, but it's not planned. If it comes up, it comes up, and then we do go in. I feel like some people can get quite passionate. Mm. Mm. I, feel like- I think you guys haven't seen. Like the height of our passion, like where people say, <laughs> "Well, like you're dumb." Don't you can't you can't say that. 
No, but even, even those things aren't edited out. We just haven't, we just haven't got, I don't think anyone's gotten infuriated to that level. You know, like in six one where we like be sitting around the room and be like, well, are you an idiot, fam? You're stupid. Man, man, bro, man, man, was, man was wishing death like on certain man, fam. It was that deep. <laughs> fam, this is um, Lil Dirk versus Weekend uh, <laughs> debate. <laughs> yeah, if you think me and Kyoja was argue, argument was bad, fam, you are, oh, bro. That one even, yeah, that, that was nothing. Yeah, that that, that, that one even considered light. an argument. Like That was very like, yeah, that wasn't even an argument to man, like you know what I'm saying. Yeah. But yeah, I feel like we would we do talk about serious stuff, but mainly some topics like we won't really talk about like I don't know, like I don't know, like cultural preparation. I, we will talk about that, but maybe not. Yeah. Like, we, so, yeah, I mean, I if it came up, if it came up in a conversation, I feel like we would talk about it. I don't think. I, yeah, I don't think it, I don't think it would come up though. That's the only thing. Do you know what I mean? If we saw it, like it could. But, but then again, technically, like, we it, about it. That's what it we, came that's up what in our mean. conversation during the, pod, the episode as well. Like, I it wasn't like something we planned, that, it just came up. Everything that we yeah, spoke about... that's true. Everything that we spoke about in this pod is, like, there's not one topic that we wouldn't speak out. We speak about outside of it. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh. Sam, if we wouldn't exactly. speak about it in private, what makes you think we'd be comfortable yeah. enough to speak about it in public and post yeah, it online? Yeah, bro. Bro. But, yeah... That's your. I feel like that was a good question to you know. I feel like to give a bit of uh, what's the word I'm looking for? A bit of context to the pod. Insight. You know? Shut up, man. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Basically, I have to take over this pod because Kyoja likes to do all the talking, but I'm gonna have to do a bit more talking to the in, in this episode because Kyoja's uh got diarrhea. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I thought. <laughs> Why do you think his arms are down? Look, that's because he's he's gra- he's grips and onto his stomach, bro. It's all lies. It's all lies. I'm just tired tired this week, but we won't let that get in the way. So let's get straight to it. I yeah, have to cool. be there. Yeah, if you have to be there, do you guys want to start off, or should I? I think do you want to start off with this year. Your favorite like summer, like what year was your favorite summer? <laughs> Or if you want to do like a top three, go on, ads. Uh, if 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 the summer, yeah, the World Cup was on, was that 2018? 2018. If that is not one of like top three, fam, I'm swinging for everyone's margins. That's top three. That's more. That what the? Three. <laughs> yeah, that's top three. I can't me. even remember what happened. England got to like oh, the semi finals. Yeah, remember, uh, bring, it, Croatia, bring it home, right? bring it home. And then, like, it'll, it'll be like the, the Euro was it Euros or World Cup? It was World Cup, right? World Cup in World Cup, yes. 2018. Yeah, so you watch the World Cup here, yeah, and then, like, literally 10 minutes later, it'll be Love Island. Then the whole TL was talking about Love Island, shit like that. Mm. Yeah, we don't watch Love Island over here. I watch Love Island. What do you mean? As well, I watch Love Island. Island. Yeah, I watched, bro. like two seasons, and then it got, I don't know, the last one I didn't really watch. Oh my God. Was was the last one? I don't know because I didn't watch it. Uh, I think Love Island one was the that the World Cup here was when AB was on it. You know, Jack Fowler is looking like <laughs> <laughs> not anymore though. No, I think he's he's got the same energy as you. Do you know what I mean like you're the, you're the same person? He's he's more like me, man. I'm the origin. I'm the originator. I think he's older than you. I came first. I'm okay. You can sort my knob. Um, <clears throat> that was a, that was a very good summer, man. I remember, I remember when England lost to Croatia. Croatia. Yeah. yeah, England lost to Croatia, bro. I walked home, fam. So upset. Oh, she mean. Where did you watch home. it? Where? Yeah. I watched on my brother's yard. Oh. Uh, Where did you watch it? I bang bang, packed out, bro. Is it? Yeah, yeah. It was, it was good. It was good. Dude, like bang, it was bang, so bang, packed bang. out. Yeah, people, people were sitting on the on the tabletops of the food stores. Do you know what I mean? Uh, you know the restaurants on the side of the wall? Yeah. yeah. They, they, they would clear like the counter and people could sit on it. That's, That's how like packed sick. out it was. Yeah. That's sick. As Yane said, shit. I'm not going to lie. I can't even. I can't. If I did watch it, I can't remember where I was. Really? I'd be at home. What was no, I doing? I'm talking about like, when, when, when was like your best summer? Oh, when was my best summer? Uh, I feel like the stereotypical response is 2016, isn't it? Yeah, Everyone always says 2016. Can I be honest? Me. I don't remember I don't, anything. That that's what I'm saying, though. I don't really remember it in terms of the year. Like I can remember specific events, but I can't. I couldn't tell you when it was. I remember it. 
pretty clearly, can't I? What happened in 2016, bro? 2016 was, was the year. 2016, AB was still in college, that's why. That was, was like hotline bling year, right? And, yeah. uh, and Kaojin was still in high school. No, I, that's, that's the year I, I dropped out of uni for the first time. <laughs> To do your GCSEs. Get out of here, man. You still do GCSEs while we were like applying to ECAS, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, ambulance driver, I'm joking. <laughs> I right, respect the NHS, blood. Yeah, yeah. yeah 2016, 2016 was a good year for me too as well, man. I can't lie. Like ever since I joined the place I work at, every summer has been good. Like, obviously, other than last summer because we were locked down there. Mm. Last summer was quite good to me, you know. I can't lie, man. Well, it was good to you. It shouldn't have been good to you, bro. Bro, like I said, but lockdown and no lockdown, bro. <laughs> you ace, man. You ace, man. But 2016 was like, I don't know if you guys remember, it was like Pokemon Go. So everyone was like out there, like just walking around. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, I downloaded it? that and played it for like two days and then deleted it. Well, you should have come and got me last time. I didn't get it. And sec, we used to go out all the time in it. It was just, it's just a good way to chill with your friends, but like, yeah. you're actually doing something while chilling. Do you know what I mean? Hold on, 2016. I think that's when Dave Chappelle came back. You know, out of retirement. I don't, I don't know. Hold on, wait one second. Let me, let me hold on. You guys talk here. Let me. Let me... <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say with Pokemon, I feel like the reason a lot of people liked it was a nostalgia, innit? Mm. It was, but it was fun as well, though. I can't lie, it was very fun. Like yeah, walk around, show your friends, collect Pokemon. Oh, like, like, we, I went out with my sister once, like late. We just we just walk in. Yeah. And looking for Pokemon. See, that's and the issue. After you do it for like half an hour, then what else what else do you get out of it? Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So he came back he came back with twenty fifteen. What's that? Nah, 2016. It was it was a good year, yeah. 2016 for me. So obviously when I when I went to you, what, what was that, bro? Nah, I had to open a fucking pickle jar, fam. <laughs> and it was wet, fam. Do you get me? So I was I had to smell my fingers. You know what I'm saying? You're a day, uh, guy, fam. What the fuck? Why are you laughing for? I can I not laugh without you making a day, bro. Not you, you horny bastard. Get out of here. After the last week, you guys were offering to suck my dick the whole episode, bro. No, you were offering oh, to suck my dick. Get out of here, man. Listen, Go it's on tape. Last week, all of it is on tape. Uh, yeah, so anyway. <laughs> um, what were you guys talking about? 2016? Yeah, 2016. I think the only thing I remember is, is like a Dave Chappelle special from, from that year. Is that it? You got 2016. That's music was good. Ago, fam. I don't, I don't, bro. When I'm talking about like, like good summers here, the furthest I can go back is like three summers ago, fam. What? Bro, I don't remember what happened in 2017 summer and 2016 summer. I could probably know. I probably could tell you what holidays have been on, but yeah. other, other than that, G, I can't tell you what happened. What the I hell? Don't know how I, people's memory bro, is this good, you know? 2016. Year, yeah. We that was years. one of the years where we used to go out to dinner all the time, like every day. No, it wasn't. It was, it was. That was around like 2014, 2015, no, 2015 times. Nah, 2015, we were, we were all still in thing, bro. Like, it's still in. Yeah. 2015, oh. we were in six form. Yeah, we left six form in 2015, like the middle of 2015. And then we obviously went to uni, uni all did our own thing. And then like around like Christmas, December time, in the beginning of 2016 is when we started going out oh, again, because yeah. everyone like patting their team in it. I don't know if you guys get this year, but like when I went in 2016, when we in 2015 when we all went to uni, yeah? well, I don't think many people get this, but I think some people might relate to this. But you know, when you go from sixth form where life is so fun and you know everyone and like you feel like kind of like the man there, like that's your people and you're mm-hmm. really enjoying it and stuff, yeah. And then you get to uni and everyone's just like, I mean, kind of like I'm not saying it wasn't that enjoyable my, for me. My yeah. first week of uni, bro, I considered moving to another uni, fam. Cause everyone, everyone in my my fucking seminars were just neeks, bro. I was like, blood. There's no way that I'm gonna survive in this place. Then I met this one brother, yeah. He came in late, in it, yeah. Just literally, just dressed like a hood rat. Came in late, and he said he ain't done the he ain't done the reading, and he sat next to me. And obviously, I ain't gonna say I ain't done the reading myself. <laughs> so then I was like, oh, cool. I was like, this guy, I could fuck, I could kind of fuck with this guy. You get me? So, shut up, my brother. 
Yeah. But yeah, I've definitely felt that. But then it didn't take your boy AB to become the man in uni either. You know what I'm saying? I feel like for me, the issue as well was like, because obviously I went through like a long drawn out breakup before that. So my, my mind was still elsewhere in it. Do you know what I mean? When I could when I could have been making friends, I was thinking about like six form and other things. And in the end, I just I just dropped out. But yeah, that, that year was good for me because yeah, basically after I dropped out and stuff, yeah, I think it helped me to like be more happy again. And obviously I was spending a lot of time with you guys, me and all, as we're going gym a lot uh, that mm. summer. And then AB, me, you, MH, Deeps, we'd go to like dinner and stuff. And then I think th- that year, I expected my dad to be annoyed that I dropped out of uni, yeah. But he sent me to America and Canada <laughs> for like a month. As a holiday in it, and also I got my first job in it, so I was, like it was a good year for me. I can't you got your first job in 2016. Yeah. No yeah. shit. I thought I thought it was earlier than that. You know. Nah, nah. I'm glad I didn't work through through six one. You know. Why? Because you know, like the, obviously, this at my workplace, the six one was work with us. Yeah, and you can tell that you can tell that like stressed about exams and stuff, but while working, mm. and like. For example, like let's say to be honest, we never had that issue because we never took exams seriously, so we didn't really have that stress of. Bro, like, do you remember that? Do you remember that one year, yeah, where we all played football before we went into exam? <laughs> one year, probably <laughs> 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 all of the years. Oh, but bro, let's say, you know, I remember. Remember our English teacher in sixth form when yeah. uh, she was like, "Oh, who's? Does anyone here have a job, like a part-time job?" Yeah, and then some people like they were enthusiastic, they were like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah, me." She's like, yeah, you need to quit it. <laughs> <We're like, "What?" laughs> she was like, you can't do this course if if you if you're working for that uh, part time. I do hear that though. Yeah, oh, but I don't I don't even think for like the, not even for the educational side of it. Yeah, I just feel like imagine so, having to leave at three thirty when all the men are chilling in the common room after school to go to your yeah. job. Do you know what I mean? I feel like that's a key part of your childhood that you don't want to miss out. That was me all throughout college, bro. What like just leaving at three thirty? Bro, I went college five times uh, a week and work four times a week for yeah. all, all, all two years for our college. Damn, man. So I would go, so obviously I'd work, I would have college from Monday to Friday. Yeah. But Tuesday, Wednesdays, I'd have half days, innit? Yeah. So I, as soon as I finish college, go home, literally change and go to work, fam. No months, no nothing. And Saturday, Sunday, I'll work as well. That Monday, I, I applied yeah. though. Like, it's not like I didn't try to get a job, yeah? Oh, blood. I remember, yeah. I think I was like 16 or 17, bro. I tried to do some leaflet job, fam. <laughs> bro, it, I think it went came down to my second street, yeah? Bro, I just, that's the leaflets. I just went yeah. over. I was like, bro, <laughs> fuck this. I was like, bro, I'm a G, fam. I don't need this shit. I needed it, but I was like, bro, fuck this. <laughs> I've, I've done that before. I, I don't think I've ever, like, whenever I've done leafling, I don't think I've ever completely given up yeah same bro and it's like a big is that bro it's the stack of leaflets like this big you know and also like the whole like you know when you go door to door yeah <clears throat> it, it starts to look like some some like let what are they called again letterboxes uh, letterboxes <laughs> wait did it just you literally well, you were just about to say it and you said <laughs> what is it <laughs> no I was, I, I was gonna say letter posting but i was thinking what the f- that's the letter posting isn't it i, I couldn't put it together in it you need to take that shit, man. That your brain ain't functioning right, bro. Uh, get out of here, man. Listen, you're making the listeners think I actually have a problem. I don't want you waste time. You do though. Wait, no, I don't. Am I lying, bro? You do. <coughs> well, Allah, you're lying. How about that? Uh, oh, wait. You, got, you can't okay, carry wait, on from wait, there. Hold on, hold on. You can't carry on from there. You can't no, carry no, on from wait, there. Wait, wait, wait. So wait, so you don't have a problem with me right now? No, I don't. Say so, Allah. Now I'm feeling. Allah, I'm feeling better now. And also, Allah, I didn't have the problem that you were saying before. <laughs> Don't try, don't try, don't try and frame me out here, bro. I won. You had to say well, you to, to stop it. I already won. <laughs> what do you mean you won? Because I told the truth. You suck, yeah, man, yeah. Do you want some emodium? You fucking demonic hoodie, bro. Demonic what? 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 Shut up, man. What does that even say? What am I, what am I top? Yeah. This is ballerina. I still can't read it. You're holding it up like it's making it easier for us to read. Don't just read what it says, bro. <laughs> it's a Sumerian. But yeah, but I can't, I can't lie. I can't lie. I was hoping that something would come to my head right now, but I didn't. 
were we, what were we talking about? I can't remember. <laughs> yeah, 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 man. Oh, sorry, Kale just a, toilet problems. That's not that's not going anyway. We're talking yeah, about no, sorry, like sorry. getting a getting a job at uh during six form. Oh yeah. Yeah, it was pain, man. Anyway, this ain't making an edit. So moving on. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm saying. <laughs> oh shit. No, Jake, I don't know why we're wasting, we're wasting jokes on a part that we can't put in. Yeah, for real. Um, All right, so, Ads, you haven't said what was your favourite summer yet. I don't know, man. I, f- I, I don't know. I feel like my answer is not going to be, like, a specific year. It's going to be, like, a, a certain event, like, mm. like a holiday. Going, uh, I keep saying this, but going to Turkey. Uh, <laughs> even Barcelona. Barcelona was really nice. Oh, gee, you went to Barcelona, yeah? Barcelona. Hey, I went with my dad and my brother. Jeez. This was after I graduated, though, like 2019. How long did he stay there for? Uh, two weeks. Two weeks in Barcelona? Yeah, yeah. Fucking hell. That's a, that's a big holiday, you know? Yeah, and then we real. went from, not from Barcelona, we flew back home and then, like, I think maybe two days later, we went to Turkey. Oh, sick, Jeez. sick. Yeah, sick. It was sick. That was nice. Guys, went on lads, lads' holiday, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so what, uh, mom and the sisters didn't get no invite here? Yeah? No, no, my mom, my, it was me and my brother, yeah, my brother and my dad to Barcelona, and then like my whole family went to Turkey. No, so they didn't get invited to Barcelona, yeah? No, nah. uh, it was a, I was gonna go by myself, and then why I get very stressed out like planning holidays, innit? Did like, you see... it, it was after I graduated, I needed a break in it, like uh, mentally, I needed to just get away and do something, yeah. yeah. So then I was gonna go, and then I get very stressed planning stuff, like planning holidays and stuff, even going on holiday, I get very stressed. So I needed like my dad there to do all the thinking, and then I would just go along and <laughs> just oh, go another day. Calm, bro. Just Google Maps. You know what I'm saying? Nah, I, Maps and I don't know what it is. Google Maps. Nah, I get you. I get you. Yeah. Yeah. The planning is that I can't do, and uh, even going on holiday when someone else has planned it, like the logistics, like, trying to get like it's like little things like you're in a country where you can't speak the language, you're trying to get a cab, for example. I find that so stressful. Like, can bro, can speak what is Spanish? going on? I can't speak any Spanish. No habla español? Si. <laughs> no, joking, no. <laughs> You should have said we. Oui. <laughs> I can't speak any other languages. It's sad. What was your favorite holiday? <clears throat> I said Turkey. Definitely. Oh, oh maybe Morocco, actually. You were in Morocco as well? Yeah, that was time ago, though. It was when I was a bit younger. But I, yeah, uh, it's between Morocco and Turkey. Yeah, we, have pitch that, and pie. we have that uh, the hash tea. Huh? The hash oh, I was a, I was a child, mate. <laughs> so? <laughs> I'm joking. That's, that's what you were munching on them pigeons, isn't it? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That pigeon pie. That nasty, oh, shit. Man. Oh, yeah. Delicacy. Mom was probably uh, America. Mm. I, thought, yeah. what? I thought you. I thought you would say France. No. <laughs> no. Paris. Why did you traumatize? <laughs> many, many reasons. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm just being a prick, man. No, uh, many, m- many reasons. He Some, said, he said, somewhat of Yeah, America's good. America again was summer 2016. That was a, it was a very good summer, man. When you said you went New York. I went to so I st- most of the time I stayed in a play- place called Connecticut. Um, oh. So that's like we, wait, ju- wait, just for the record, we know where Connecticut is, bro. You might say we stayed in a place in Connecticut. Like, <laughs> it's called, Conne- called, called Connecticut, fam. People might not know, innit? Do you know what I mean? It's, it's famous for like a ha- hauntings, innit? You know the haunting in Connecticut. Mm. Like oh. I think there's there's a there's a street there called Sleepy Hollow as well. What I'm like. an idiot. I was about to say it's famous for KFC. <laughs> <laughs> what? That's Kentucky, bro. Yeah, I know. Oh, I know. My, oh my. <laughs> Wait, what gave, what gave you that impression, bro? No, I, I don't know. When you said it's famous for, uh, KFC just popped to my mind, didn't it? Yeah, you it think, you're thinking American is being fat and stuff, innit? Yeah, it was the K. <laughs> it starts with a C. Can it start with a C? I swear that. <laughs> <laughs> See, AB, when you were saying, like, oh, yeah, we know where it is and stuff, yeah, this guy didn't even know where it starts. With. Uh, I, uh, bro, I, I apologize, man. Chill out, man. 
Yeah, but now most of the time I stayed in Connecticut. <laughs> <laughs> Man said it's the case. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I was thinking like what gave you that head to it I think you just think of the KFC bro I think you're hungry man uh, I am do you want me to order your KFC nah, no, I don't think anyone's hungry for your KFC bro. <laughs> it's gonna I'm get you a six piece of dry chicken <laughs> I didn't make it it's it not my fault <laughs> you ordered it bro no but yeah so most of the time I stayed in Connecticut and then I went to uh, New York for a few days that was did you good. go to the Empire State uh, now, so this picture is that like is behind me. It's from the Rock- Rockefeller Building. Did you take uh, that yourself? Yeah. Oh shit! Oh. New York. Yeah, it's it's sick, Concrete bro. jungle where dreams are made. <laughs> bro, you know it's crazy. The rats they are mad big. You know. You say rats. Yeah, bro. They are like they have. You know they have. I think because of like the conflict between humans and rats, there yeah, they have genetically modified. Like super rats, basically. Super sized rats, bro. What the fuck are we talking about? Strongest I, survive in it. The strongest I, survive I, in it. I literally read an article <laughs> saying that, like in America, in New York, they have like super sized rats. Like fat ones, bro. And I, don't I saw know them what... in the park and stuff, innit? Bro, I don't know what I'm going to do with this information. Just be wary in it when you go to New York. I want to stay in New York. Um, I have no desire to go to the US, you know. Really? Yeah, I feel like it's such a messed up country. Yeah, that's that's true, but it's a vibe though being there, isn't it? And I feel like it's it's too similar to to the UK. Mm. As in, it's in terms of culture, it being a Western country, I feel like it's not really that exciting. Yeah. I'd rather go Canada than America, to be honest. I went Canada. So Canada was sick. Mm. What did Can- you say in Canada? T- Toronto is probably my favorite city in the world that I've been to. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, because I, I feel like Toronto is a lot like London. In terms of yeah, it's, it's, it's like London and like New York, but it's less busy than New York and it's cleaner than London. Do you know what I mean? So, anywhere like, cleaner than London, man. perfect. No, not New York, bro. They got super sized rats. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, man. I don't know, man. What was your favorite event that happened last summer? Last well, last summer, we were like, I was inside the whole time, bro. Yeah, yeah nothing was. Nothing happened, man. Like, what was the summer before? Uh, what about 2019? 2019 was good. That's when I went to Barcelona. Gee. I feel like 2019 will be legendary for everyone, yeah, because it's always going to be the, the the summer that they remember was the good summer before lo- lockdown and the mm. coronavirus pandemic and everything. Yeah. I, mean. I think that's the year, that's, that's the summer I started driving as well. I just started <clears> driving <throat> before that summer. Oh, bro, that summer was sick, fam. I just clocked, bro. That summer yeah. was sick. It was lit. That summer was sick. I, went, I went Lake District as well that summer as well. Oh, yeah. You look yeah. pagan. How, how does that make me a pagan? What the hell? Who's, who's the pagan? Because I went with my other friends. You're going to damn other friends? I've got hella friends. Bro. I mean, I don't have any friends, so I'm checking. No, you do, I'm man. Just... You're, 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 you're a popular guy. I'm not going to argue against that, but, you know. Yeah, sharp. Anyway, <clears throat> ads. What was your what was your uh, favorite event of twenty nineteen? Twenty nineteen, uh, me graduating. Oh yeah, I feel like that was because like I don't know if I mentioned it before, uh, but my like me going to uni. I I never planned to go to uni. Uh, it was something that I didn't actually want to do, uh, and then in my gap year. Uh, my sister like convinced me to go I was just doing it just to get a degree in it I, it wasn't something that I wanted to do and then while I was doing my course I like that's when I realized that that's what I wanted to do in it as a career so I feel like considering the fact that it was never planned and it was something I was totally against like graduating was a big thing for me I think so I was did very you do the whole like stuff. graduation ceremony and everything yeah Jeez. Although I graduated in like June, my graduation ceremony was in November. It was so weird. So I had to wait so long for my graduation. I think that's how it is for a lot uh, of people. I think that's normal, G. Because yeah. I finished, I finished my degree in like May or something, and I had my, and I had my graduation in like July or August or something. Oh right. Yeah. I thought it was. I thought it was weird. I had to wait so long. So you finished your course uh, in July. 
in June. I think my, like, so me finishing my course, it was actually just me finishing placement. So my last day of placement was my last day on the course. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> and that was in June, I think, beginning of June. And when did you say you, gra- you actually graduated? November. So my my ceremony was in November, yeah. That's 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 actually quite a long story, I can't lie. Yeah, yeah. now that I'm thinking about it. It's... Yeah. <laughs> I yeah, got my certificate like and everything before, like, what? maybe two, th- two, three months before my actual ceremony. Oh, shit. Yeah. Do they give you your certificate, like, at the... That's what I, I got my certificate at, the ceremony, at, at yeah. graduation. They gave, bro, uh, so my certificate, my certificate was posted to me. On, on graduation, they gave me, like, a rolled up piece of... I, I can show you. I've got the thing here. Like, one sec. <laughs> so, they gave us this, right? Yeah. yeah. So, it says class of 2019. Yeah. yeah, 2019. And you take that thing off. It's literally just that. <laughs> <laughs> that leaflet, bro. That looks yeah. like Chai Wallace menu, fam. Because <laughs> they posted our, our degree to us already. So uh, thing, that thing was handed to me on the stage. Yeah. What, the, the scroll? They, they the the today, fake right? scroll, yeah. The fake scroll. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> <laughs> did you guys do anything in your like graduation walk? You know, when you're walking on stage, like, did you do anything like showboy? Nah. nah, I was nervous, I waved at I waved at my lecturers like they were sitting on the stage in it. Oh, my yeah. friend shouted out my name. I liked it a lot. My friend shouted out my name, but that was that was that was about it. I was just scared. I did I didn't I didn't want to trip because I felt like fucking yeah, Voldemort with the cape on, fam. I swear it on. <laughs> I just didn't want to trip on my thing. And I'm wearing small shoes. I I don't wear like suits and shoes and that in it. So I'm, yeah. I'm very much out of my comfort zone. And it was so blood. I, I mean, it must have been the hottest day on the of the year, fam. <laughs> my graduate. Bro, I am pissed, fam. I'm so I'm so drained of energy, fam. And then this, and then I, I'm just just walking there. I wish I could show the picture, but I can't both to get up. But yeah, man, it was alright. It was, it was it was it was a cute it was a cute day. I initially yeah, my, did, I, I initially didn't want to go, but ended up going. You know, my sisters one year. Um, they were you know Jack and Wilson. The, yeah, the Tracy Beaker. Yeah, the lady who wrote Tracy Beaker, yeah. Dustin Bieber, all that stuff. Yeah, she's like mm-hmm. one of like the chances at their uni. So she was there as well, like introducing them and stuff. No that's way! Weird. Yeah, that's sick. Yeah, I can wake my work <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, you know yeah. When like when me and my older sister got a little bit older, yeah, Tracy Beaker was bad for my house, you know. <laughs> I wasn't allowed to watch it. My dad said, "Yeah, you you lot are getting attitude from this program." Yeah, yeah, same. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I remember my, my boy wasn't allowed, he wasn't allowed to watch um, Dennis and Nash, Dennis the Menace. Really? Oh, shit, yeah. 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 I, was, I wasn't allowed to watch Simpsons, you know? Same. Same. I wasn't allowed to watch Simpsons at all, but I ended up watching it anyway. Yeah, you know yeah, the bad thing is, I'm always that scared to say, like, oh, I wasn't allowed to watch Simpsons because everyone's like, what? You weren't allowed to watch Simpsons? What's wrong with it? And, I, and like, you, you two are the first people that also weren't allowed to watch it, you know? Yeah. I don't know why. <laughs> it's not even that deep. <laughs> like, I think when we were kids, like some of the stuff in there is kind of mad, isn't it? Yeah. I feel like, I feel like it's because they have um they'll like put like adult jokes that only adults will recognize. But as yeah. kids, we don't know what that stuff means. So there was there was there was people in bikinis and shit, man. I don't know what what version of the Simpsons you were watching, bro. <laughs> like, you're watching that's... the hentai version for <laughs> 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 that advert like, oh. <laughs> no, but I've seen that. That, that was on TV, bro. What's, that was, what's that the was private web browser, fam? What's, what's the What's the guy that stands up like like is that this Burns? Yeah, Mr. Burns, but his assistant. Yeah. I forgot his name. The Mr. nerdy Smith. guy, something like that. Yeah. Is it oh Smithers or something like that? Smithers, yeah. yeah. Yes. Is it Smithers it or Mr. Smith? I thought it's Smithers. Oh, sorry, that, that's Matrix. I'm bugging out. Yeah, you think of Agent Smith, bro? Yeah, Agent Smith. I wasn't yes. allowed to watch. I was allowed. I wasn't allowed to watch Matrix either. Yeah, same. But I stole the fucking DVD, so I had to watch it. Bro. <laughs> well, there were so many movies, yeah. That I was. I wasn't allowed to watch um, Pirates of the Caribbean. I watched Pirates of the Caribbean when I was like twenty. Why? Because I was sensitive. Yeah. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. Brothers, my brothers, I am joking. Please forgive me. But it literally says Pirates of the Caribbean in the I, name. I yeah. know that's <laughs> a joke, man. Come on, man. I, I'm just joking, brothers. Please. That's it. We're done out here, bro. You're finished. This this is this what happens when you let me take the stage. Right? You should do all the talking. Anyway, yeah. Now my mom used to take like 
uh, you know, age ratings, like the, you know, the actual age ratings, isn't it? Yeah. So yeah. if it was a tw- if it was a twelve, she'd be like, no, you can't watch it. If I was you remember, eight. yeah, like see see the start of before every movie, there used to be like a piracy, like a piracy. Yeah. And then it you was wouldn't like steal a car. It was so dark. Yeah, fam. It was so dark. Yeah. Well. It was like someone. And the music was like, like it was like Jeff Hardy, bro. It was like Jeff Hardy's <laughs> intro song. Yeah, bro. It was so dark, fam. Like, is that piracy was wrong or something like that, bro? It was so scary, fam. Yeah. Um, they used to play that shit all the time, you know. You wouldn't steal a car. You wouldn't yeah. break in someone's yeah. home. Yeah. Piracy is theft. But obviously, they didn't say it. They would just show it with, like the heavy metal music, X Games, and all that stuff. Yeah. In the background. X videos. X Games, bro. You don't know oh. what X Games is? I don't know what X, X Games is. Yeah, I don't know what either of those are. X Games is like skateboarding. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like Tony Hawk. You know, there's a bunch of like people in this generation that don't know who Tony Hawk is. So. What? I know he's a skateboarder. That's all I know. Bro, he's and there's a game, icon, there's a game based you know. on him. Did you not play the two games? Man, bro, I never PS2. had a TV, fam. <laughs> I never had a PS2. Oh. My first console was PS3. Um, Tony so, Hawk was so, iconic, so what, what, you know. When was like the like? How did you get your first TV then? That like, what? What was the conversation? So we had off. We remember it like back in the day in the classroom. The rollout one. Yeah, we had it on the stand. Yeah. Yeah. So we. Did had you guys that. have the stand as well? Yeah, yeah, we had the stand and everything. No way. And then, yeah, and then I don't know what happened. Like my parents, they didn't want us to watch TV or something, so they took it away. Uh, and this was for years. Uh, and then uh, we probably, I don't know, I don't know what caused my parents to get another one. Like, it wasn't even a conversation that we had. I feel like we just came home one day and there was a TV there. And so we just started yeah. bugging out, like, <laughs> what the hell? You know, what is this sorcery? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and then, yeah. I, we, I went a good good portion of my, my childhood without a TV. I, I'm trying to think when we got the TV back and it must have been maybe like toward the end of primary school, beginning of high school, maybe something like that's, that. That's, that's, calm. To that's like, calm. In primary school, you don't need to be watching TV. You know what I mean? That's calm. Bro, like, I didn't get internet. I didn't there. get internet. I didn't get, I didn't have internet until I joined high school, fam. Oh, we had, com- we had like, like internet and computers and stuff, but TV didn't have. For me, so you're, 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 you're before the time, bro. Nowadays, we don't watch TV yeah. and we're always on the internet. I, I had dial-up, fam. But I remember <laughs> dial-up, bro. Yeah. <laughs> bro, it was so jarring. Like, you play, you play a game, yeah? And your mom's, your mom's like, I need to speak to someone. <laughs> yeah. You, you don't even, bro, she didn't even say it, fam. One, once the internet cut and you see that fucking, see that little file transferring thing. The, the, yeah. the like, the, like the microwave, you already, you already know, fam. Your mom's just on the phone, fam. Um, you gotta switch to like Minesweeper and Pinball. <laughs> yeah, for real, or Solitaire or some shit. Yeah, yeah, you know, to this day, though, I still don't know how to play Solitaire. Nah, yeah, Solitaire's so... sick. I like playing Solitaire. Bro, basically, I got a burger here, but am I really gonna claw it off in front of the in in the pod, fam? Yeah, get a knife and fork, G. Fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> Eat your chest, man. Go on. Go on. Yes. Get your lips around it. I'm not involved. <clears throat> you enjoying it? <laughs> <laughs> for any for anyone who's wondering why AB has his mouth so far away from the microphone, yeah. <laughs> Last week when I was editing, this I'm just you know I'm just gonna blame the late late post on this. Yeah, the reason why the episode came out so late is because AB was smacking his lips into the into the microphone, and I couldn't listen to it while editing in it. So yeah. that's why that's why it took so long to edit the episode and put it out. I'll smack my lips when I eat. He, I'm not gonna do it in it because I don't want to smack my lips. Yeah, but this guy was like, <laughs> "That was you last night." <laughs> Disgusting! Disgusting! Gobble gobble. You bloody turkey! No, nah, I'm joking. <clears throat> I, I was gonna say for the next one, yeah. You do like favorite cartoons, but then you just told us the whole story about how you didn't have a TV. Yeah, like all these cartoons that our age group used to watch when we were younger. I, I didn't watch. I used to have to like try and go to my grandma's house yeah. to watch Boomerang. We used to watch like Tom and Jerry and stuff on Boomerang, and that's that's all. That's the only TV I had that was at my grandma's house. Boomerang was sick. They used to have yeah. like 
the summer of like Scooby Scooby Doo summers in it. Like yeah. the whole summer they showed Scooby Doo, and it'll be like those Scooby Doo movies. So sick. Fam, I remember we were so gassed about my grandparents having a TV instead of us. Like we we used to go there to watch the bloody Olympics. I remember like distinctly, like it, it was before. I think we were going to Cornwall, and like yeah. the morning before, like we were all at my, my grandparents' house. We were just glued to the TV watching the Olympics. I don't know why I remember that so clearly. Weird. That's very cute, man. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like we had that, but with with sky cards. Like I would love going to people's houses if they had a sky card. <laughs> yeah. You know, in, you know, in school, yeah, when people used to talk about like Disney Channel shows, yeah, but bro, I used to lie. Freeview, fam. I used you know to lie free, when it came to you, Disney for Disney Channel, you might, bro. Do you might know about Freeview? Yeah, come cool. On. Bro. When I got my TV, that's when that's all we had was Freeview. Bro, Freeview was, bro. And we had a Freeview satellite TV, like, film for all that stuff. Bro, I still remember the first day, yeah, when man transitioned from having like five channels, yeah. To having like 20 extra channels, fam. <laughs> I was like, bro, what is this, fam? And it, it, it telling me I could watch CBB, CBBC to seven o'clock. Bro, <laughs> bro, I, I thought I was a G, fam. I still seven remember the I still remember the song, you know. It's like, and now has come the time to say goodbye. Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> and do you remember, yeah? Like AB before, knows what I'm talking about. Like they, they have a song about. right at the end of it to say like, goodbye and CBB's, to the morning. Like <laughs> CBB is the last show, yeah, was was 64 Zoo Lane. I swear it was a story maker, though. Know? You know, you know, it used to piss me off, yeah, because they always used to end on that fucking blue cow. I hate it so much. No, bro. that blue cow was a G. Blue cow every, time, me off, every time I see that blue cow, I was like, oh fuck, it's gonna end. But then it's still because CBBC CBBC finishes at six in it. Then I was like, fuck it, I'm gonna watch CBBC because it finishes at seven. So still, you still have that like, one hour of like television left. Bro, if you had three of you, yeah, surely you should have finished on CB CBBC and then gone straight to Tiny Pop Pop, bro. No, I think that was some bad man shit, man. Nah, uh, <laughs> Tiny Pop was sick, bro. You never, you tell me you never watched them shows like, um, what's that one? Tim, if you goes to school, bro. You never watched Tim if you goes to school. I remember Listen Tim up. if you goes to school. That was a banger. There were so many yeah. show, six shows on on Pop and Tiny Pop, bro. Interesting. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it's tough out here when you, have, when you have didn't have like the Disney Channel stuff in it. Yeah, yeah. Because you go to school and everyone will be like, yeah, did you watch Zack and Cody yesterday? I'm like, no, what the fuck? <laughs> I said, Zack and Cody. I used to lie, you know, and she'd be like, yeah, yeah, that was sick. And I'll let them tell me what happened. And they were like, yeah, 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 that's sick, that's sick, that's sick. Yeah, that was sick, that time was sick. You know one thing I didn't remember? About the, um, you had to be there, you, the, um, the journals. The, you know, where you, where you, uh, where you write your homework? Purple journal. You had to get it signed, you had to get it signed every week. Yeah, yeah, and like, did you lot used to like fold the days where yeah, yeah. the weeks that you already yeah? <laughs> yeah, yeah. What the There's fuck two ways is to this? Fold it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. You, fold you fold the, the corner, top, then the bottom, and then on the next one you fold the bottom corner. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I don't know why we did that. Yeah, <laughs> that was so weird, fam. Those those hands are so weird. I I never used it for writing homework in though. I just draw random shit in it. Yeah, and then when it came to signing it. Like I need my mom's signature was so easy, and I just yeah, same. <laughs> I feel like even now I have the same signature as my mom because you got the same like initials in it. Yeah, but what's what's mad? Yeah, is they used to get so emotional if you didn't if you didn't get signed in it. Like, bro, I school. never had. Bro, I didn't know what a South journal signed journal looks like, fam. It's because you joined in year ten. That's why. No, even from my first high school, bro. I don't know what like. Oh. Uh... I was gonna say, yeah, these these put like stamps in our journal as well. If you did well, you get a stamp in your journal at the back. Mm. It, it didn't really work because they never really motivated me to to like try and get them. Do you know what I mean? Was there a prize for the stamps? I can't remember. Yeah, you get like weekly prizes. Uh-huh. And shit like that. I never got into that shit ever. Oh, do you remember in primary school if you had neat handwriting you got to use the pens the red pens i don't know i remember that yeah i never got them <laughs> same same i, I feel like only two people got pen license in my school in my class no nah, bare people bare people from my from my class got them our, our school must have been dumb like two people were in my i was never on that level man to this day my handwriting is terrible yeah i was gonna say i think even now i don't think i'll get the pen license yeah <laughs> 
Although I feel like I, I write neato when I use pencil, you know. Mm. I don't know what it is. You said pencil? Yeah, when I use pencil, my handwriting is very neat, but not with pen. I need doctors and shit. Like, we'll have bad handwriting. Yeah. You can't so, read their prescriptions. I'll take comfort in that fact. Or you might just all say eight. <laughs> you were literally in set eight, so I don't know why you're talking. <laughs> I've never been lower. I've never been anything lower than set two or three. That's a lie. That's big fact. What are you talking about? Where? That's a lie. Where? Where? Huh? Where? Was you where? Wait, 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 Eight to year nine, I was in set nine, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even know sets went that low. Man. No, but you know what it was, yeah. I'd, as you had this as well in the lower lower school, it yeah. went from one to seven, and then eight to eight to fourteen. It was I mean, one to like, six, no. I thought it was one. There to was seven, twelve. Right? There was twelve sets. No, there was four, fourteen in our year. We had fourteen. I'm pretty sure there was twelve. You were in a different year, bro. That's why I said oh yeah. Do you know what I mean? There was 14 in my year. Really? Yeah, like, because oh. I was in I was in 9 DLA, which is basically top set, but it's DL because it was double language in it, so they put us in the second set, so we didn't get too cocky in it. So what, set 9 was set 2, basically? Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, but it was, like, double language in it, gifted. That means set 8 was set 1? Yeah, set 8 was set 1 in our, in our year. So if you're set 8, then... You're chatting out of your fucking bio well, again, bro. Well, well, that makes sense. Well, I'm being serious. Because we, you know, you said Red Journal and Purple Journal. If you're in a Red Journal, you were set one to seven. If you're in a Purple Journal, set eight to 14. It, that's how literally how it worked, bro. You're chatting a whole lot of poo right now, bro. Listen, if you're in Kingsbury High and you were in our year, you can back me up on this. You just hold on. I, I don't remember ever. We said, we've said Kingsbury High so many times, bro. I'm talking about, I uh, hold on my location. <laughs> we said it so many times. But then even, e- even for you, <laughs> then even for you, Ads, in your year, set eight would have been set two, basically. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yo, set eight, man. Shut up, man. Get That's out of here. Do you know it's because our, our school was so popular. Man said, where's the mass? This, it's not comprehending for you because you don't understand mass. Come on, bro. I've got higher grade than you. In mass? <laughs> yeah. Go on, then. What did you get in GCSE? I got an eight. Go on. Say what line. <laughs> No, Say one line. Away. Say one line. What did you get? What did you get? Go on. No, no, let's let's drop the topic. Nah, go on. You put it up in it. You might as well. What did you get? Table. I got a B. Huh? I got a B. Yeah, I got higher than you. No, you never. Anyway, what are we talking? We, this 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 ain't we ain't talking about summer. Listen, you went to the go there. You had to be there when you got a C in there. <laughs> we want to catch the D. Oh, get out of here, man. You got a D. <laughs> I didn't get well. I didn't get a D. <laughs> you saw what you said, bro. <laughs> no, I've said you have to be there to see. I've been, I've been, I've been like trying to do something funny. So I said, why don't you catch this D? Well, there's there's nothing funny about your pulling grades, man. My grades were quite good, man. Say man, say man. I don't have to retake like a couple man. You have to retake yeah, yeah, 12 like five times, bro. That's all GCSE, fam. <laughs> I didn't retake GCSEs. You had to retake SAS. Nah, I, you know, yes, success is where I peaked my life. You know, I, I got five, five, five. Slow down. Yeah, come on, bro. I was smart as a kid, and okay. you know, when you get what to high school, you have to start trying. Did you see that? I think I got five, four, five. That's sick, bro. I got four, four, yeah. five. Yeah, we're not surprised. Guess what? The five, four. <laughs> <laughs> science. Yeah. Yeah. Man. Would you say science is your weakest subject right now? Nah, maths. Maths. Yeah. Always hating maths. maths. Always, always, always hating maths. I never liked maths, bro. I used to love maths and hate English. And then it switched. I used to love maths and hate English. And then for some reason it switched after GCSE. Same. Yeah. Because, you know, in lower school, yeah, we're we're, we're just like... (laughs) (laughs) I love it because Ads was like, yeah. <laughs> yeah <I know. laughs> 
What are you going to say in lower school? No, I just feel like in lower school, it was all like, you have to learn like verbs, grammar, all that stuff here. Yeah. But then when you get to like GCSE, then you, there's more creative work in it. Yeah, yeah. And like more anal- analytical work. And then the mass is just like memorizing loads of shit and not understanding shit. Fam, I was forced to take English at A level because I flopped everything else. So I was literally, I could only take three subjects and I was basically forced to take the three. But it was good though. I really enjoyed English. Yeah. It's funny how life You're works, welcome. isn't it? You're welcome. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, for real. I like who would have known there yeah, a few years later that us three would be in a pod fam. Yeah, you know, it's actually very, very mad because, for example, like AB, if he didn't get kicked out of his old high school, he wouldn't be with us. That's true. He, wouldn't, he wouldn't be in that English class. For me, if I didn't like yeah. get all used in my first year of A levels, I wouldn't have been able to take <laughs> English the next year. Because, you know, I tried, yeah, in my, in my first wait, year of A levels. <laughs> you tried and you got a U. <laughs> no, 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 no. I, didn't, I don't mean I tried in my exam, fam. I didn't try in my exam. Get out of here, bro. Get out of here. I tried, I tried to take English in it. And obviously, Senior was like, no, nah, I don't think English is a, would be a good subject for you. You won't, you won't Fuck do really you well. Bastard, it. Fucking Which makes no sense, yeah, because obviously, you guys were in my class. English was easily one of my strong suits, innit? Yeah, yeah. And he was like, no, nah, I don't think you're able to do it. It's, there's too much coursework. It won't be the right subject for you. Uh, too many essays and stuff, yeah. So then I flopped all the subjects I did, and then the next year, I did all essay-based subjects and did well. I thought, like, what the fuck? Mm. Do you know what I mean? That's why I hate when like, teachers try and make judgments. They don't even know you, from. That's the first oh. time I met him. He's trying to tell me I wouldn't be good at essay-based subjects. Bloody loser. That put you said that we'll never get into uni, fam. <laughs> <laughs> now, here we are, man. Right. Look at us now, jobless. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right, man. It's all right. You know, all that, yeah. And I still hasn't told us what his favorite summer was. Oh, I, I, I told you, I can't put a year to it. Do you know what I mean? I can, I can remember that going on holiday to Turkey or Morocco was probably my, like, either one of those is my favorite thing to do in summer. Was that 16 or something? That was 19. 19. 2019 was, uh, well, I've been to Turkey before, but I think in 2019 was, was probably the best. Because we're familiar in it with it, and we're comfortable there. We could go out like by ourselves, just just chill. To be honest, AB, you, have, you haven't said your favourite summer either. I would say either the World Cup summer, so 2018, or the summer I started driving. Oh, yeah, fuck it, 2018, 2018 and 2019 was the thing. Because the summer I started driving, huh? Put them as like a combo in there. Yeah, the summer I started driving, I was just so... Jesus Christ. Um, The summer I started driving, like, I was just active. Like, not one day was spent in my yard. Like, there was always always something to do. And 2018, obviously, World Cup. Uh, What what else happened in 2018? I can't believe you didn't watch Love Island during that time, man. I never watched. I never watched one episode of Love Island in my life. You moving like some? Why? 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 Yeah. Why? I just don't, bro. I don't watch TV too tough. Like I watch this. I watch. Mm. I I I rewatch Friends or Fresh Prince of Bel Air like all the time. It's true, you know. I don't really watch TV that much. Yeah. I feel like it's a it's a good like, because you know with Love Island, yeah, you'd watch it. And then, like the next day, you go to work, and everyone's talking about it, and it'd be mm. like a good conversation topic. Do you know what I mean like it's also hella? It's it's, it's I don't know. It's just dramatic, isn't it? Like, yeah, I enjoyed it while I was watching it. Yeah, but it, I think I feel like uh, one of our friends like kind of was pressuring me to watch it, and that's the only reason I watched it. It was a girl, wasn't it? Uh, nah. <laughs> uh, so that yeah, that's the only reason one. I watched it. If it if it wasn't if it wasn't for him, it wasn't. Uh, I would not have lied. You see the way he <laughs> went. It wasn't for him. <laughs> so on purpose, like just like no, 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 it was a guy. They, I'll tell you for free. There's not one guy in this earth here that's forcing another guy to watch Love Island. Do you want to know who it was? But you were basically on the show in it. That's why I wouldn't tell you to watch it. <laughs> we should do a man named Love Island. Fuck off, man! What the hell is that nonsense? <laughs> <laughs> Must have done man the love just, island. Just man them. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, wait, <you> don't fam. <laughs> yeah, imagine man them just come to each other and be like, "Why are you talking like you didn't you, like you did an arc of ads the last week?" <laughs> fuck off, man! What is this nonsense? This guy, you still get a little bit of sign of there. Uh... <laughs> Some of your mum, bro. Get out of here. Amy, Amy wants to pull up to the man them like, "Can I, can I pull you for a chat?" How, are, who, are, you know, the worst thing is, yeah. 
I think out of the man, then AB would do the best on Love Island. Yeah, definitely. 100%. I don't even know what, what is there like celebrity? Is there like uh, I'm a celebrity where do, they do like challenges and shit? They do challenges, is, but not like challenges. I'm yeah. So, what's the, like the main thing? It, as you want to explain, it's like single people go in this one villa, they stay there, they're blocked off from the outside world, and uh, they're supposed to find love. Um, and they like they like partner up with someone of the opposite gender and they do yes. challenges and stuff yeah. and then obviously the the production team like try and spice things up yeah. you know I mean? like and, and like inject controversy in, in the challenges and stuff so, yeah, yeah. It's, there'll, it's be like, the, the, there'll be like challenges like where so obviously they do this like like a lot towards the end in it so there's one where they'll have like public tweets about what the public think about the couples inside in it so mm. there's one I think like Stormzy there's one from Stormzy yeah? a tweet from Stormzy saying like oh this girl is fake and she don't like her man and stuff yeah and like it just causes so much drama like they just get so emotional about it, like oh why does Stormzy think that yeah. and they start arguing for the whole like week and stuff like that. he it's don't seem like sold in it but <laughs> I feel like AB would be the best on it and then I think second best would be is JJ <laughs> I'll call. I'll, I'll okay, just call hell, man. I'll just. I'll just call I have it. But... Uh, I don't think you would, you know, because it's on national TV. <laughs> <laughs> bro, I don't. I don't care. Yeah, I mean, and any, and also, if you know, if you win, yeah, you get like, was it fifty thousand pounds? So yeah. how, how do I apply to this to this thing? Oh, and the public, the public vote out each week, like yeah, do they want to vote out? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm have to apply for next year, fam. I think it'd be good on you, you know. But <laughs> I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> Why, man? It will blow up the thing, man. The, the pod. I, I think some things, some things are more important than the pod, you know. Like what? Like what? your market, fam. <laughs> <laughs> well, for fifty bags, bro, I don't, I don't care about no market. <laughs> Last week, this guy was saying he's trying to settle down with a nice homely woman, I and am, I say, I yeah, am. fuck it, fuck it, 50, 50 bags, I'm going to go on Love Island. 50 bags, but I can give a look at 20 bags, of, dude, break a little bread, you know what I'm saying? Should also, you know, you know, like, to get on there, you have to have social media, like, presence, you know? Oh, yeah, fuck mm-hmm. that, I ain't, <laughs> yeah. I ain't got no pictures of me showing my face like that. Do you know one thing, yeah, I'm going to miss a lot in summers, yeah, is having Ramadan in summer, like... Mm. The weather's still going to be good in April, you know? No, but like you know, the long summer yeah. nights in Ramadan, like you play football just before iftar, then go get munch outside, and then I like, just chill the whole night, and then eat again at like Suhoor. Although fasting then, is going to be easier, so that's something to yeah. look forward to. <laughs> but it, it didn't really bother me too much, you know. I, like I, I can go the whole day about yeah, it didn't really bother me. How was you lost last Ramadan? Yeah, because it was a lockdown, isn't it? First lockdown Ramadan for you, man, didn't it? Yeah, I think the like you know in Ramadan like. Obviously, use it as an opportunity to, uh, like, better yourself religiously, yeah? Mm. And I feel like going to Tarawih and stuff and going to the mosque, that helps. And we didn't have that last Ramadan. Um, so, yeah, I feel like it... I don't know, it didn't feel like Ramadan, really. Can I, mm. can I say something controversial? Yeah, go on. Uh, I'm, a, I'm not really a fan of Tarawih, you know? <laughs> I get hella tired, you know? <laughs> That's one thing that was clutch about the last lockdown. <laughs> 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 I don't I don't know if I could be saying this out loud, but I'm trying to be honest with it. Like this guy's Buddhist. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> no, no, no. Just yeah. So obviously there was good things, like um because we had so much time we weren't doing anything. Like mm. you could you could focus on 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 yourself a bit more. Yeah. But I don't know, I feel like going to the mosque and like even weekly jummas and stuff like it was a it was good to keep your iman levels up mm. but we just didn't have that so yeah it was good and bad in it i feel like i need to say more like religious good things in it because all i put to be so far was yeah i'm losing yeah. I, I, yeah, I, I don't like the <laughs> like, bro it's calm but all this knows that knows that you're hindu yeah yeah man yeah yeah <laughs> And on that note, <laughs> Fam, nah, nah, we nah, did nah. not even stick to the topic today, man. It's calm, it's calm, isn't it? It's calm. We can we can make it into a whole I feel like um you had to be there as a topic could become a whole series, in it? Like we could do summers, mm. we could do holidays. <laughs> Stop saying that shit. <laughs> it just comes out, man. What can I do, man? 
That's what your mom said. I'm joking. That's disgusting. <laughs> that is disgusting. You naughty, naughty. <laughs> uh, all right. So uh, obviously that episode, we kind of improvised it because uh, you know we're just going off um, like the topic today of uh, you had to be there, and we kept we didn't have that much time, so we kept it to summers. But obviously, you know how it is with the Titan talk. We can't really stick to a topic, you know. When we start talking, we just start talking about random shit. I don't know how it happens, but it always happens, isn't it? Yeah, for all like Kaojin's toilet problems and that. <laughs> oh, like, don't say that as the last thing yet, because they're gonna take that as truth. If anyone's, it's, true. it's not a truth. It ain't, it ain't the truth. Yeah, uh, last week. I'm not the only one that heard that noise. <laughs> <laughs> last week, the, last week, you and us were weaving this story about like uh, something nasty, yeah. About, well, about like, you, you being a uck as bad as oh my nice. days. And then this week, you make up some fake story about like I don't know what. <laughs> That's a crazy story, it, bro. You just had diarrhea, bro. It's not that deep. No, I didn't. You waste time. It was cool, but on that Listen, note, bye. no, 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 no. There's no on that note, yeah. Listen, <laughs> AB. So if you enjoyed that episode. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Um, Even if you didn't like it, like, sh- like, share, and do all of that good shit, man. It don't cost you nothing, man. It don't cost you nothing. Yeah. For and if you did, free, if you did enjoy it, obviously share it with your share it with your friends and your family. Obviously, as we said, just like Love Island is a good conversation star, Titan Talk is also a good conversation topic. Do you know what I mean? Because we don't mm-hmm. want the conversation just to end with us. We want you to also be able to like go online and talk to your friends about what we said. Do you know what I mean, use our topics as a conversation star. Um, and it really, really helps us out as well. Do you know what I mean? And if your friend don't watch Titan Talk, cut that bitch off. off. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say something wholesome, that's why I said something like mad, but I didn't know we were both gonna say something mad. <laughs> Bro, it's me. If if I'd said if I'd said that you could you could you could believe that he's gonna say something wholesome. Me. But <clears throat> no, nah, this is oh, an yeah. act, remember? Huh? This is all an act, remember? Oh yeah, sorry man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. But yeah. We got something. We got some good things planned for you guys coming soon. That we're gonna be unraveling that in the upcoming months. Do you get me? So stay tuned. Follow up. Like, share, subscribe. Pray for Kyojin's bowels because right now he's struggling. <laughs> See you, my next week. Bye. No, no, no. No, no, no. no, 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 no bye, 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 bye. bye.